Hey guys, it's Canon98 here, and today I have a VMP class setup for you guys. So before we get into this, can we please hit 10 likes on this video? That'd be greatly appreciated. So as you can see here, I'm using the grip, the quick draw, and the long barrel for the VMP. So first of all, we'll go we'll go straight into the long barrel. The long barrel increases the range on the VMP. The grip it reduces the recoil when aiming down sight, so it's pretty handy because the submachine gun it tends to bounce quite a lot. And then we're using the quick draw grip. Uh, again, that's just standard really, you, you aim down the sides faster, and uh, going into the gameplay here, we're playing on Skyjacked, and uh, perks I was using this game, I was using Ghost and Six Sense. Six Sense, I really like that perk, um, one of my favourites now, I started using it over Overclock, and I really like it because I just find I get kills easier and more kills if I use Six Sense. So I can still earn my specialist pretty quickly, as I'm still using the Annihilator in this game as well. And as for perk 2, now I have two options for perk 2. You could use the uh, anti-up or you could use fast hands. Fast hands is pretty good as well. After sprinting, you aim down the sides faster. And I've noticed that makes a huge difference, but um, you have the quick draw grip on, so it won't be at the end of the world. Like, but. It still it still helps if you want to sacrifice the quick draw grip you can put on fast hands But the only thing is then it'll be kind of harder to get your kill streak So I decided to put the quick draw grip on and choose anti up instead of um, Fast hands and then for perk 3 I'm using blast suppressor now I'd nearly be tempted not even to use a perk 3 on this uh, class Because you could maybe even use an extra attachment like you could use a suppressor on this but it just kind of nerfs the damage on the gun, so I wouldn't really recommend it because I, I was using the suppressor on this for a while because I like suppressed guns, so um, I started using it then without the suppressor and I found that I was playing much better in games. Um, it, this gun, I can only really recommend it for small maps, close maps like Nuketown, Combine, and even this map Skyjacked, but if you were to use it in a much larger map, it wouldn't really be as effective because it doesn't have great range, but um, that's when you need, say, the likes of the ICR or the KN kind of assault rifles or so on and so forth. So, anyways, this gun is actually really good. I have a gold as well because I've used it quite a lot in early prestiges. Um, one of my favourite submachine guns, it's, it's up there anyways, with the best. Um, so, yeah, guys, I hope you enjoy this. Please like and subscribe, and I'll leave you with the rest of the clips.
Thank you.